All right, next up tonight, Phoenix football. Full 16 box auctions. It's, the case is so monstrous, I can't even show it to you. I know, we just need HUDs. There's your teams. I mean, you know, you won the auction. I'm going to start, I'm going to pre open while you look at those teams. Oh, yeah, what happened to Zimp? I forgot about Zimp. I never heard he didn't say anything like I hate you, I'm never coming back. Jeez, these come out slow. You'd think the weight of them would yeah. pull them out. <laughs> yeah, who are the Bucks playing? Or they played already, huh? Yeah, they won yesterday. Yeah. Giannis is so good. That's not really my... Even if they were really good, I've never been accused of Bucks. Yeah. I mean, I would root for them, of course. And, but. Yeah. The NBA in general has never been the biggest passion. Yeah. No, I'm more than Two health bars. You said you write, you root for Ryan Braun more than anything? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What did you say? LeBron. Oh, I LeBron, LeBron, yeah. More than anything in the NBA. That's why when you know everybody was going and I made such a stink at the games these last two days. Yelling at everybody. Rooting for Ryan Braun. Oh, right. Omni got a little bit of flack from the Dodger fans at the game. He wore his Brewer's jacket. They were giving him some crap. We saw a couple of guys get escorted out by police for messing with some Brewers fans in the bleachers, but thankfully we were in the bleachers, otherwise it kind of got ugly. Yeah. Everybody was pretty good-natured. That was. Yeah. Like I said, that first game, the one only one guy said anything scary to him. What was it? What did he say? Well, he was, I think, joking. But he was like, put this on. He had a Dodgers jacket. And he's like, it might save your life. Oh, yeah. And he wasn't really smiling when he said <laughs> Yeah. Hold on, I gotta sneeze. All right. Sneezing session over. Oh, Phoenix. Yeah, they did. Poor Giants guy. Oh, it's kind of different looking this year. I like it better. Joe Mixon to 2.99 and a Royce Freeman right off the bat. Nice relic. Old Germans, Denver Broncos. I'm going to I'm going to go kind of fast just because it's a lot of cards. At least they have the number cards backwards, I guess. Dante Jackson, rookie for the Panthers. Eli Manning autograph. Oh, most valuable Eli Manning, two-time Super Bowl MVP to 49. I thought it was an autograph. Yeah, I really like Phoenix. Yeah, that's nice. Melvin Gordon to 25. It's even more Phoenixy this year than last year. It's like, I don't know how to explain it, but it's more, they're like titanium looking. I can't open these packs. Oh, what is this? Like the hot packs? Winston Hill, Red Favre, Fountain Rookie, Lazard. There's like rainbowy hot packs. Did they do that? I think they did that last year. Every time. I don't know why. Edo Smith. Numbered rookie. Yeah, like even that farm insert has the... Yeah. Dalvin Cook number. Trubitsky to 299. Andrew Luck, QB Vision to 299. Lamar Jackson. Yeah, they're more titanium y. Titan -y. Remember Titanium Hockey? 
We have a Derek Carr to 199. And Mark Walton, rookie patch autograph, Cincinnati Bengals. Josh F. There's our first rookie patch auto. Matt Ryan to 99. Stafford. Mason Rudolph, rookie, numbered for the Steelers. Sean Jackson to 199, agility. <laughs> Anthology hockey. No, titanium is worse than that. Anthology wasn't that bad. I kind of liked it, actually. Keekly to 149. Jules and Ryan love Anthology. Titanium was really bad. You might be talking about the year, like the... Oh, oh yeah, oh my god. <laughs> yeah, never mind. That's the worst ever. I was in that break. Jeez. You were? Yeah. That's I awesome. still have some giant Brett Hull uh, relics that don't go with, you know, they don't have yeah. any. Jarek McKinnon to 75. I'll bring those in so you can put them on your backdrop <laughs> there. And a on Johnson rookie jersey auto to the Lions. A little German. Bargain Lion spot. God, I forgot about that stuff. I guess I finally sold off the last case I had. I don't know. There was some interesting, like, huge patches and stuff, but, like, it was still oh, so bad. Yeah, the patches were cool. It's just that they couldn't, they couldn't, um, they didn't have the license, so they couldn't do anything to make right. it look like a hockey card. If those patches were in like something else, they could have been great patches in the cup or the or prime or anything. It's Patrick. Le'Veon Bell to two ninety nine. Yeah, is it like Ultimate or something that has those mega patch cards? Yeah. They were like that. They just yeah. like you said, they just weren't. James Washington parallel. Kelsey. Trey Quinn. Like that, just worse. Yeah. Synergy. But Synergy was kind of affordable. Oh, here's another rainbow pack. David Johnson, Kirk Cousins, Joshua Jackson. I don't know what to do with those. They're not numbered. Dalton Schultz to 149. David Johnson to 199. Unmatched. <laughs> Magic football. Worst. It is the worst. Clay Matthews to 149. There's a Patrick Mahomes to 299 QB Vision. Wait, what's the worst baseball? Oh, Platinum. <laughs> Bowman Platinum, worst baseball product? No. No, I don't think so. Darius Fountain, number to 299. We have a Jaleel Scott. Rookie jersey autograph. It's got to be Panini. Swish, your Ravens to 199 Worst baseball product of all time. Looking cheap and unlicensed. I'm trying to think. Trey Quinn. Baker Mayfield rookie. 2013 triple play. Man, I don't know what that is. Triple play baseball. I don't know what that is. Zeke to 299. Yeah, Chronicle. Uh, I like Chronicle. Yeah, I like Chronicle. Okay. Plus, you got to think about the box price. I think about like Chronicles is better than like Prism used to be. So. Oh yeah, the old Prisms. Yeah. Oh my God. Those are bad. Trubitsky to 199. Yeah, the first couple prisms were like, there's no color. It was just base, 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 base. Nick Chubb, jersey. Shaquem Griffin, rookie. Then actually, prism got kind of fun. They had a lot of color, and then they don't make it anymore. It's all only in Chronicles. Just a base pack. 
Archives postseason. <laughs> Pretty bad. Devontae Parker to 299. And nice Bradley Chubb, rookie patch auto. Well, German, your Denver Broncos. That thing's numbered 47 to 50. You're not going to believe this, but there's Denver Broncos hits in 18 football. I know it sounds crazy. The thing about Archives postseason, though, is it's super cheap. Case Keenum. That's a nice Barry Sanders. Unmatched. Number to 75. Worst tennis set. Yeah, all. <laughs> Hashtag pun. Just so you guys know, next week I'm on vacation. I may do like a quick Wednesday night break sesh before I leave, but I'm not even sure about that now that everything got pushed back. Lamar Jackson. Numbered parallel. Paint Manning to 299, most valuable. I'm gone from Thursday to like Monday, so I'll be back the next week and we can knock out a mil. There's going to be so many releases waiting when I get back. Flawless baseball. Prism football. I think flawless basketball is that week when I get back, too. Andy Dalton. And a Jalen Samuels rookie patch auto for the Steelers. Which wax? I don't think any basketball got pushed back. Yeah, cup is... Everything in the world comes out on the 31st when I get back. It's like cup, flawless basketball, uh, well, Stranger Things, which I don't know if we'll do. Derrick Henry. We might do it, though, because I love that stuff. I love Stranger Things. Tune in to see Sam's Halloween costume. Yeah. I'll be wearing my Halloween costume. I don't know if the cup got pushed back, did it? It said 31st last time I checked, but that was... A, Almost a week ago. Edelman to 299. Tops Tech, yeah, I think so. Matt Ryan QB Vision. It's literally everything. Just think of a release, it's coming out on the 31st. 24th? November? Did it get pushed back? Kind of makes sense. They never come out. The, the first time the cup is announced, it never comes out the day they say it's going to come out. When it first is announced, ever. Didn't it come out at like Christmas last year or something? Next Wednesday? The 24th? Got pushed up? No way. I don't believe it. Yeah, I'll believe that when I see it. That'd be cool because I can break it on Wednesday night before I leave. Checklist is out. Oh, that'd be fine. No, no, I don't think you're lying. I think they're lying. There's an Andrew Luck to 25. Would I lie? My dude, Anthony Miller, I think he had a touchdown last mm -hmm. week. Chicago Bears, Dave. Anthony Miller, rookie jersey auto. Anyway, what I show is Marvel Masterpieces, which Jules is going to do a little bit of. Jalen Samuels. There's a Tom Brady to 299 QB Vision. It did say 31st at first. I don't know why they moved it up. Anyway, um, when I get back on the on the uh, 28th or whatever, Flawless Basketball, Tech Baseball, Stranger Things, Triple Threads Baseball, and the Cup is what it shows me now, but who knows. I'm thinking Triple Threads might. Triple Threads or Tech maybe will be moved out, but I don't know. Ooh, that Camara corner is destroyed. Minka Fitzpatrick to 75. How much cup? Like a couple cases. Maybe two or three cases. There's a bunch of the rainbowy parallels. None of them are numbered. They're unnumbered rainbows. <laughs> Flawless auction. I don't know. The Immaculate Auctions went really cheap. Maybe I'll just do regular teams. Matt Ryan to 299 Ben Roethlisberger. Halloween Parallel. So Jules is going to break next week while I'm gone. 
because update comes out on Monday for some weird reason. I have never heard of a Topps release coming out on a Monday. But update baseball comes out Monday. I don't know why. Machine green for the Seahawks rookie numbered. And then... Uh, what was I going to say? Update on Monday, which ruins every plan. And then archives, regular archives baseballs on Wednesday. So they're, they're going to do like Monday, Wednesday, or Monday, Thursday. I might do Wednesday night, and that might be it for the week. Royce Freeman jersey. Cup and update mixer. <laughs> Cup date. That's not happening. No one would go hitless, or well, I'd be hitless. No one would go cardless. Put those back there now. Since the deadline is approaching. Van Der Esch to 99. We have Ido Smith, rookie patch auto for the Falcons. He's had, he scored a few touchdowns yeah. since. Uh Got hurt. That's true. Tim, that thing's number to 75. Edelman to 299. You guys excited about flawless basketball? Tony Gonzalez to 299. My box and a half, I got a flawless basketball. I got a box and then like an empty they, briefcase from somebody. They give you an inner but none of the case kind of. <laughs> yeah. Like the little, they give you the little box. Connor Williams to 149. Things are made out of glue. They're made out of like spider web. Golden Tate. And to a hundred Josh Allen relic. Poor Josh Allen. Go grab your bills. It was all setting up so perfectly for vacation because all there was was update and Update Hoops and Archives next week, but then they moved up Flawless Baseball, which is weird. Joshua Jackson. Zeke, Adrenaline Rush to 199. I was just going to do Prison Football on Wednesday night, maybe a little Hoops. Harp, do we dare do a Triple Case Hoops player auction? God, that'd be ridiculous. Jarek McKinnon to 75. QB Vision. Hold on. See you later. <laughs> Here's the rainbows. Mason Rudolph, Antonio Callaway rookies. Is there one of those in every box? Yeah. Well, if it really comes out on Wednesday, I can do it because we're not leaving till Thursday morning. Lamar Jackson, rookie, to 2.99. Tom Brady. I will totally do Cup on Wednesday if it's if it exists on Wednesday. Josh McCown to 1.99. Going to Hawaii, baby. J.R. Alexander to 199. Haven't been to Hawaii for. Hold on. Nick Chubb, rookie jersey auto. Last time we went to Hawaii, my son was like one or two, so it's probably been four years, four or five years. And my brother and his wife and their baby are going, and we're gonna. We're all gonna hang out and. My brother's wife has offered to watch the kids because she's she's got a baby anyway, so she can't really do anything fun. So she's like, no reason for me to make you guys not have fun on the vacation. I'll just watch all the kids and you guys have fun. And we're like, okay, <laughs> deal. 
So this time I might get to go to Hawaii and like actually do stuff without kids having to go to the bathroom or eat or cry every five seconds. It might be fun. I don't know. I want to get my hopes up. But I might actually enjoy myself this time. Dante Pettis to 199. We're only going Thursday through Monday. It's only four days or whatever. Aaron Rodgers to 25. Bodyboarding. Josh Rosen relic. What if you have a terrible, out of shape, overweight body? Can you still bodyboard? Is there dad bodyboarding? Dad bodyboarding? Le'Veon Bell to 2.99. I'm excited. I can't wait. It's gonna be awesome. QB Vision Joe Flacco. Saquon rookie. Oh, David Price tonight. <laughs> My body will be in the board. Redemption. Luke Falk. Purple rookie. And triple patch autographs. I didn't even know that was a thing. Oh, for the Vikings. It's like a triple autograph thing. It's not like three patches with an autograph. Adam Thielen, Dalvin Cook, Stefan Diggs. Beer maker. Cool. $21 Vikings. What a deal on that auction beer maker. Good job. Triple patch autographs. Dealing Cook and Diggs. That's a nice Vikings hit. Did I tell you guys about my last Hawaii vacation? Jamon, Mar I probably did, but you guys are all, all the people I told back then have since quit and found way better things to do. Except for Rasmus and a handful of people. A handful of sufferers. Somehow I haven't found something better to do. One of us is so in such bad shape, the better thing they found to do is actually Yeah, come they out got here. even closer to it. Josh McCown. There's not really much of a story, it's just that we went for like five days, and the only part that I remember being fun is we went snorkeling. So we went out to... Uh, God, some bay, something, something bay. If I had any Hawaiian friends in chat right now. Larry Fitzgerald. Number parallel. We went to this bay and uh, snorkeling. Hana Bay. It might have been. It was around Waikiki. We stayed in Waikiki Beach and then we drove a little ways over there or something. Took a. I don't know what we did. It wasn't the Bay of Pigs. Tyrod Taylor to 299. And Doris Fountain, rookie jersey auto for the Colts. Bears 197. <laughs> anyway, we went to this bay. Oh, we took a bus. Actually, I remember now. I think it was Hanna Bay. Hanna Bay. And, uh, you know, we got to the snorkeling station. There was a big snorkeling station where they have all the snorkeling gear and everything. And I got all outfitted for that. Dak Prescott to 75. And then uh, my daughter was like five at the time, and I thought she would want to do it, but she was too scared because it's kind of, you know, it's kind of scary, I guess. And my wife couldn't do the snorkeling because my son was like one or two and couldn't leave him, and he couldn't do the snorkeling. So I went out there in the water, and uh, I was prepared to die out there. <laughs> I just, I, don't, I was out there for like four hours. It was amazing. I lived in the sea. McCarran, Camara, McCarran, yeah. Goff, White, and Adams. If I had never come back from that bay, it would have been fine. I'll well, get another shot, maybe this. To, to never come back from that bay this, uh, next week. <laughs> yeah. McCaffrey to 149. It was amazing. Chris Carter. That was the highlight of the trip. The rest of the time was crying babies, going to the bathroom, feeding them, whatever, problems, fighting, sunburn. But that three hours or whatever it was, oh man. 
I was just hanging out with turtles and weird different fish. No one was talking to me. There was no noise. Just the, the breaking of the waves and the, the shrieking of the sailfish. No, there's no sailfish. The shrieking eels. Yeah, there's no annoying people on the airplane. Oh, man, it was so nice. Luke Falk. Anyway, we're doing that again this time. I can't wait. Doris Fountain, Jersey Auto. Bears 197. This one's tough to keep up with. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff in here. If you've never gone snorkeling, I don't know where you can go. Besides, I've only ever been in Hawaii. Anyway, you should do it. It's amazing. Most fun I've ever had. Julio Jones to 199. <laughs> Edo Smith again to 100. Jersey Relic. Carson Wentz. I think there's much, but I think there's like some crazy snorkeling locations down there and like whatever. You guys, have any of you gone to like, uh, Mexico, I guess there's probably. Yeah, Mexico snorkeling. I've never been to Mexico. Jimmy Graham. Never been to, um, what is this? Aaron Rodgers Relic, Veteran Materials. That's sweet. Kuna Montana. I've never been to, you know, like, Southern. Southern. Caribbean. Yeah, Caribbean and all that kind of stuff. Have you guys done that? You gone to, like, exotic vacation locations? I've been to Hawaii and like Stockton a couple times and LA. Those are my main vacation spots. Lorenzo Carter. Jordan Howard at 299. You ever toured the In N Out headquarters? <laughs> yeah. I went to Lodi once. <laughs> yeah, Omni and I stopped by the In N Out headquarters on the way home. It's pretty cool. Suggs. Colored parallel. I actually thought that said least valuable for a split second. Why would they do that to Joe Montana? It's most. Do you have tropical islands in Sweden? Here's the rainbow stuffs. Calvin Ridley rookie. I thought it was all ice and snow there. Javon Wims, numbered rookie gold. Joe Montana to 75, most valuable. Finish. <laughs> Lauletta, rookie, numbered. Swedish fish. Cortland Sutton to 199. And rising rookie Sony Michelle, football hat autograph. Kuna Mankata. Number to 125. Swedish fireballs. Almost through the first box. Jerry Rice. Cap tipping? Now, believe it or not, we've done six boxes of the 16. When am I ever going to not be gaining weight? I'm just, You're telling me, pal. God. I'm getting so ridiculously fat. David Johnson. Ballage rookie patch auto. Perco. Number to 25. All Omni and I do is eat garbage every day and go someplace, other places and eat different garbage somewhere else and drink a bunch of garbage. I'm going to be eating a bunch of weird Hawaiian garbage. Donuts. 
some different grilled garbages. Yeah. Joe Flacco to two ninety nine. Yeah. Dodger Stadium food and beer is not a good diet. I need to get back on the keto this winter. It's going to be rough. Hashan McCoy to 199 And DJ Chark Relic for the Jaguars. Golden Jaguar. Hey, you think of LA food as being like healthy, but we ate like no. fried chicken and maple syrup between two waffles. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. It's we good, went, but... What was that place called? Bob, uh, yeah, something with a B. Bruxy? Bruxy. Do you guys have Bruxy? Tannehill to 49. We went to a place that has specializes in sandwiches that are a waffle on the outside and fried chicken -y stuff on the inside. It was really good. Bruxy. Well, it's probably Bruxy because it's good. But um, the um, it's over like the eye or something. Weird. Oh. I, don't, I don't know how that's supposed to be pronounced. DJ Chark. Carry on Johnson. Rookie Patch Auto. All the bread is waffle. You know it, Edit Droid? 75, Carry on Johnson, Rookie Patch Auto. It was really good. The only thing that I didn't like is uh, I just tried to order a Diet Soda, like a Diet Coke or whatever, and they're like, oh yeah, we have Diet Cola. I was like, yeah, okay. And then I found out it was Diet Caffeine Free, like house made cola. That's BS. Diet caffeine free? What's the point? The only reason I'm drinking diet soda is all is just for the caffeine. There's nothing else about it that would be useful. The Sean McCoy to 199. Yeah, tip to all you restaurant tours out there. Just have a Coke machine. Yeah, you don't. We don't need your fancy craft soda. No, yeah. It didn't even taste good. Yeah, and I had a regular one because I wanted the caffeine. It's like a Coke would have been. Yeah. <laughs> Jaleel Scott. I was drinking it like, what am I, why am I drinking this? This is no point to drinking this right now. That guy was kind of a tool, too. Yeah. Rashad Penny. Yeah, definitely. We had a real, like, cool guy, counter guy, whatever. Mahomes. In the... Unless he's watching. <laughs> yeah, he's not watching. <laughs> He was. <clears throat> I was wearing my Dodger hat, and he goes, "Hey, uh, did you hear that prices are twenty percent higher for Dodger fans?" I'm like, "Dude, you're in L.A. What are you talking about." Well, we were in Dil uh, Huntington Beach, but still, it's still L.A. He's like, "Yeah, well, I'm from Northern California, so." I was like, "Cool, shut up." I'm from. Are we all? Yeah. Make you I'm from Northern California too. Whatever, get out of here. Shut up and give me my <laughs> caffeine-free diet soda. <laughs> Getting grumpy over here. There's an Eli Manning yellow plate one of one. You could barely see him. That's what Eli looks like to defenders. He's like a ghost. Can't even touch him. But anyway, the food was really good. <laughs> Autumnal stuff, so... No thanks to him, the food was great. If I worked there, I'd be like, oh, did you want a soda? Just so you know, it's not real soda. Do you still want that? It's like this weird fake soda we make that sucks. It's just chemicals and food coloring. <laughs> yeah. Lamar Jackson to 199. Frazier Frazier, WWE tonight? I wasn't even suggesting that. Hey, we got another plate. Antonio Callaway now. Hmm. Wait, I thought that said yellow. That is not a yellow plate. Incorrect. I've seen yellow plates. They don't look like that. That appears to be magenta. Yeah, that's a magenta plate. Error card. All right, Michael Gallup relic.
If that's a yellow plate, things have seriously changed in this hobby. It's, the hobby has passed me up. <laughs> it's time to hang them up. Jordan Reed to two ninety nine. Yeah, those are the same color plate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Terry Bradshaw to one ninety nine. Off yellow. <laughs> it was weird because I said, "Can I just have a diet soda?" And he's like, "Yeah, one diet cola." And I thought, like, "Hmm, that's weird." That's not a food way to put that. Yeah, I don't usually hear people say diet cola. Mike White, Larry Johnson autograph. Wow, man, he was really good for mm -hmm. a short period of time. Actually, it was not he was that good short. For quite a while, yeah. Marby. As long as the running backs are good for the most part. He might have been one of the first kind of guys. Because at what year did running backs just get thrown away when they were like in their late 20s or early 30s? That didn't happen in like the 80s and 90s really too much. Yeah, did I don't it? know. Kurt Bankert. That's the first guy I can remember when I was doing fantasy going like, how did he go from being amazing to dead to just out of the league? Now he went somewhere else. And then something happened like he got in trouble or... Really? I thought he signed with another team, but he just never. I don't know. He's one of the like from. Aaron Rodgers. One of the first classes I remember being in college and going to the pros. Oh yeah, Penn State, right? At Penn State, yeah. Oh, that's right. He was behind Priest Holmes, and he finally got his shot, and then he was awesome. And... But then it didn't last very long. Drew Brees. I swear he either made a comeback or like signed with some team and just was no good. Yeah, he was a stud. <clears throat> T.Y. Hilton to 199. Oh, it's QT. He's actually pretty good, this guy. H Town Shot Collars. QT rookie jersey autograph. That's a new one member. Yeah. I don't know. I've never seen that name. Unless he changed his nickname. No, I just I remember. A oh, okay. Peruvian. Randy Moss. Too long ago, a few days ago. Yeah, welcome H Town. I call the shots around here, by the way. You got H Town. I got this whole setup. You can have H Town though. I will call zero shots in H Town. Philip Rivers. Tank Johnson. Oh yeah, Jamal Charles. Here's your rainbowy ones. Jalen Holmes rookie. Out and Tate. Oh my god, that's half. <laughs> Good news is we're halfway through uh Phoenix. Oh Boydstone, that's you. There you go. Jones to 199. Rising rookie Cortland Sutton. Piece of football auto. World German Denver Broncos. Steelers hits. Yeah, wasn't there like a Jalen Samuels? Yes. Auto. Yeah, yeah Butchwax. There's Jalen Samuels relic auto so far. We're only halfway through. And probably like. At least a dozen numbered cards. Yeah, there's a, every team has 700 numbered cards. I've seen this Tom Brady in a lot of different iterations. That one's the 49. The thing is, yeah, we've got this Phoenix that's kind of a longer break, but after this, it's five star and immaculates, six. Two Immaculates and four Five Stars, and they're like four seconds each, so it's not going to be a super late night or anything. Hayden Hurst, if your break is coming up later, you're not, you know, they're going to go quick. Don't worry, it's not going to be too late. Minka Fitzpatrick, there's been a lot of different Fitzpatrick parallels. DJ Moore, Jersey. Did he have a touchdown last week? 
Oh, uh... No, he had like two fumbles. Oh. He yeah. might have scored a touchdown too. But. Rex Burkhead to 299. Dalvin Cook to 299. How are you guys feeling about National Treasures Baseball and Bowman Chrome HTA? Are, are you done with that? Do you guys want more? I'm trying to figure out tomorrow. Should we do some HTA Chrome, some NT, along with some mixers? We're going to do that high-end mixer. Roquan Smith, rookie. Numbered. I don't know if you're burnt out on the old Bowman Chrome and NT. Collins Breeze, Carson Wentz. Sony Michelle rookie. Sony Michelle's looking pretty good lately. Mm -hmm. Sony Michelle again, numbered rookie. And Andrew Luck QB vision. Any Lions hits? Yeah, you've had like two uh, Carry On Johnson, maybe a patch auto and a relic auto. I think. I want to say there's been two. Anthony Miller to 25 rookie green parallel. Yeah, a real nice patch auto. Yeah, a nice patch auto, a little German. And then I know there was another one. Roethlisberger to 299. Ronald Jones. Oh, yeah, like one of the first, was a jersey auto. It was like one of the first hits. Yeah, Ronald Jones. Jersey auto for the Buccaneers. Golden Jaguar. What a deal. $23 Buccaneers that everyone passed on the auction. Wait, Red Raider, why are the auctions so hard to deal with? Can I give you guys a tip on the auctions? How to make it really easy? Tyreek Hill to 199. Did you know? First off, did you know you can watch auctions if you have the well, you can watch them on the website or the app. Here's what here's how to make the auctions easy. Get the app. When I post the auctions, watch. Figure out like whatever teams you're interested in and hit watch. Then you'll automatically get a notification like three minutes before the auction ends for whatever teams. So just uh, when you get that notification, just check and see what they're at. And then you'll be like, nah, it's too high. Or wow, that's really low. I'm going to get it. That's all you got to do. You don't have to follow every single one. Just watch a couple and you'll get notified. You didn't have to bid on it. You can just watch it. Dante Pettis. I mean, that's how it should work. I don't know if it's actually working. I don't know. That's actually happening, but that's how it's programmed to work. Julio Jones to 299. We're adding um, the ability to pay for the auctions in the app this week and watching from the app because I think you have to watch that. You have to like click on it and then go in there and hit watch, but I'll put it like right next to the thing. Lamar Jackson. Numbered rookie. Tom Mack. Retired signatures for the Rams. Tom Mack. Never heard of him. Golden Jaguar. I always wonder how Panini or Tops gets a deal with a guy like that. Like, you know? Yeah. It's... Does, like, his agent reach out to Panini and be like, hey, Tom, uh, Tom Mack is interested in signing again. He hasn't signed. You know, like, do they pitch them? Or does, like, does Panini and Tops, like, we need to get some Tom Mack stuff. Jordan Howard to 199. We would like to be in the Tom Mack business. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm not that's not saying anything bad about Tom Mack. I just like even if it was, you know, you know, like when Charles Barkley started signing again for basketball, do they go after him constantly or does like Charles Barkley's people say like, "All right, Chuck's ready to sign again." Like how does that whole thing start? Like you would I would be really surprised if for Barkley, Panini isn't, like, yeah. trying to go get him. But, yeah, like, Tom Mack, I would, yeah, you wonder if there's, like, something to do with the players' union or something that they're, like, hey, we would like guys to sign whatever, or, mm -hmm. you know, I don't know. Zeke to 199. I don't know the answer. Hmm. Like, I'd rather they get Tom Mack in a product here and there than the same guys that they all, you know. It's cool to see a guy you've never seen. He might be in the Hall of Fame. I don't, yeah, he's like the know. greatest player of all time. I'm not talking crap about Tom Mack at all. QT. I just don't know how that happens. It's just interesting. Especially if you're listening, Mr. Mack. Yeah. You're my man. 
Like I just put myself in the shoes of working at Panini or whatever, and like, how does that happen? Yeah, he was inducted into the Pro Football Hall of Fame in 1999. Oh, really? Yeah. Because like, I wonder if they have been asking him for years. Like, here's a Hall of Famer that we never, you know, get in anything. It'd be cool to have him, and then their estate or whoever's in charge is like, nah, he doesn't want to do that. And then they finally get him. And they're like, so what product will he be featured in? They're like, oh, Phoenix football. What the hell is that? Carlton Davis. I know, here come all the Tom Mack haters on YouTube <laughs> blowing me up. Tom Mack fan club. Josh Rosen. Oh, number to 10, too. Baker Mayfield. Oh, no, it's not 10. 70. 70 of 70. I saw 10. I'm sorry. Baker Mayfield, rookie jersey auto. Bono's Joe. Oh, pro. <laughs> Numbered 70 of 10. My eyes just wanted to see the 10. I wanted it to be a great patch autograph. I should have known it was the classic to 70 numbering that we see in every product. Phoenix is famous for it. Yeah. Dak Prescott, veteran materials. <laughs> 70 of 10. One of them. Yeah, we did have that one time. Did you guys ever see that card I pulled out of Bowman that was actually numbered higher than the <laughs> yeah. other number? It was like 26, 26 or 25. 25. Yeah. That's only happened once. The Sean Jackson to 299. That should mean that's the most valuable card I've ever pulled because it's the rarest of all cards I've ever pulled. Yeah, I think it was Eloy Jimenez. I've I've had thousands and thousands of cards. Oh, was Eloy too? I think. And that's the only time that's ever happened. Number to 25, Kyle Lauleta, Patch Auto Rookie. Kuna Mankata. Yeah, you wonder if they made... They probably just made 26 of them. Yeah. Just ran an extra one through the thing. And... Maybe, like, number 21 got all mangled, and they were like, ah, oh, just make 26, and then we'll just put it in there. There's really only 25 of them. Yeah, who knows? Case Keenum to 75. It's a great mystery. Yeah, we'll never know the answer. I swear there have been like a half dozen Lamar Jackson yeah. numbered rookies. Yeah, there have been a lot of Lamar Jackson numbered rookies. You're going to get a lot of numbered cards in this break. Josh Gordon in 99. Former Cleveland Brown. Lazard to 299. Gallup to 149, and to 75, I think I got it right, Josh Rosen Relic. Josh Rosen Rosen, big grab your Cardinals. They might be playing, oh, it's only 4.30. Josh Rosen will be on the, on the tube any minute now. Andrew Luck to 2.99, Tony Gonzalez to 2.99. The, uh, <laughs> you've never, well, yeah, obviously you've never sorted Phoenix. I would say Phoenix is the heaviest shipping product of all time. Like each person's teams, team bags, they weigh like 50 pounds. It's crazy. Because there's so many yeah, numbered, numbered things to top load. So you, and they're heavy cards anyway. Callaway. Then you top load like a thousand of them. It's crazy. Everyone's getting flat rates this week. Yeah, you guys will get your packages and be like, whoa, this thing weighs a ton. I must have killed it on those breaks. Yeah, we're burning through top loads, too. Yeah, they take sure. a lot of top loads. Nick Chubb to 199. Nicker Mayfield rookie in there. Mm -hmm. 
Deshaun Hand. And Nick Chubb, a jersey auto. Bono's Joe, your Browns coming alive. <laughs> no way. Jimmy G, aw. Rip Jimmy G. So much hype going into this year. What a bummer. Uh, I need to do a base dump, believe it or not. Believe it or not, I'm running out of base room. Hang on, I need to get a crane to get this Phoenix base out of here. <laughs> That's awesome. Sick AF patch. It was just a football hat relic, probably. We're down to the last five boxes. Oh, they're called Color Burst Hot Packs. It says so right on the top of the box. I never learned to read. Alex Smith to 75. Edo Smith, Jersey Auto. Is that number three? He had said two autos, I think, and another relic. Okay. I think. Edo Smith on the board. Tim's Falcons. Yes, Topps Tech is a good candidate for grading. The only scary thing about Topps Tech would be the surface, because sometimes it can get a little scratchy. But usually, the um, centering and corners and edges are real nice. Just got to check the scratching. That's the only thing. Look at the surface. Rudolph. Oh yeah, I would grade the crap out of that. When was that? This la was that last weekend when I was gone or whatever? Sonny Michelle numbered rookie. Here's your color burst hot pack. Another Mahomes. Josh Allen rookie color burst. Oh, a month ago. Royce Freeman to 149. <laughs> Five-star number one's last, I know. That's the rule around here. Everyone fills them in reverse order. It's really weird. Well, the weirdest thing is that was the one that had the most spots sold when I was, like, looking earlier. Oh, today. really? Yeah, Immaculate's rough to grade. Yeah, those can be really... Yeah. With the color borders and stuff. This stuff, I mean, not that you would want to grade a ton of Phoenix, but this is the type of stuff. It's hard stocks, thinner kind of style cards. Another Josh Rosen relic. The smaller the card stock and the harder, the better. So Immaculate is the thickest card stock, softest material. It's the absolute worst for grading. Lao Pao. Uh, Dead Bradshaw. Stuff that's borderline that's tough to tell is like uh, Spectra. Because they're thicker, but then they're like, they have like a hard coating on the card. So like it could be okay. But it's kind of scary because they're just the thicker stock ones just seem to get beat up. Leo Jones to Sometimes two. Sometimes the backs of those cards aren't made as, made of the same as the front either. Yeah. Oh, there's a Mason Rudolph helmet relic auto. That's number to ten. Actually ten, not seventy like I like the other one. Butchwax. Number to ten, Mason Rudolph helmet relic auto. Already sent. Oh, 
Wow, we're 55 minutes in on this thing. Golden Tate to 199. Good thing I feel great after that. I'm all refreshed after that trip. No, not really. I'm still tired. But... We got that Artifacts 20 boxer and a Phoenix Full Master. We did some serious base tonight. Chris G would be hyped. Out of my store? Yeah, I have some hobby boxes on the shelf of the store. People come by every once in a while and buy one. Fountain to 99. And Anthony Miller to 199. Another jersey autograph of the Bears. It's almost. Oh, awesome. Thank you, Strouser. Why can't you guys be more like Strouser? Give me my props. What a nice guy. Strouser's my new best friend. Marquise Goodwin. It's okay, Strouser. They don't say it, but they all they all love it. Mikey even comes by, or not Mikey. Brian comes by once a month now. That's how much he loves it here. Devonta Freeman to 199. <laughs> Sean Jackson and Julian. <laughs> Unlocks the front door from 6 to 602. No way, Omni's here now. I appreciate that. I try my hardest to make it as fun as possible since, you know, that's the only thing I can control. Duke Dawson to 149. 250 points. So I'll grab 250 top loaders. That'll be enough. And it honestly might not. Wow. <laughs> They'll take you for granted soon. Isaiah Oliver. Tom Brady to 299. <laughs> That's funny. Yes, I'm currently not accepting any more dependents. I already have way too many dependents. Saquon Barkley to 199. <laughs> Josh Rosen to 75. We have fun here. to 299 and oh Josh Allen wait let me check number to 10 it's not a 70 oh it's a patch what a letdown big grab Josh Allen patch to 10 <laughs> yeah I wouldn't even break into Sweden and steal Rasmus away and smuggle him into America <laughs> You're missing out. Darius Geis. Josh, what up? Yeah. That's what it's supposed to be. This is supposed to be your guys' fun escape time. Zam Darnold. Almora tier one batting off, awesome. Hmm, what did Rasmus say? I missed it. Uh. <laughs> Drew Brees to seventy five. Down to three boxes. 
Oh, I got a sandwich waiting for me. What time is it? Five. Hmm. Sandwich break next? It's always a tough game to play. I'll wait until <laughs> you know you have something. Yeah. Uh, Watts. Another Anthony Miller, rising rookie. Oh, that's a nice patch, too. Dave, look at that. Another Anthony Miller, rising rookie patch auto with a weird, foldy, kind of patchy looking thing. Oh, yeah. Girly to 149. <laughs> what a sick AF patch. Alan Hearns and a 400 point card. I know, that's the thing. Whenever I think about when to eat, I'm always looking at the next break and going like, anybody who's in the next break when I say I'm going to eat is like, ah, a-hole. Just starve to death. I don't care about how hungry you are. Open my cards. Keenan Allen to 299 I mean, sure, you guys say nice things in the chat every once in a while, but when it really comes down to it, you just want me to open those damn boxes so you can see what cards you have. I'm one of those people. Yeah. AJ Green to 199. I could be ha I could be suffering from a heart attack and be like, but yeah, but immaculate's up next. Maybe could you just do my immaculate real quick? And then I'm sure the paramedics will still have time to. You can pull. call the ambulance, but I'm not <laughs> yeah. right here. Yeah, I mean they're just gonna be driving through traffic. Might as well just start the next immaculate break. You die, you don't die. I need an RPA. MJ Stewart. And another... How many Josh Rosen relics we got in this case? A lot, apparently. I have an Italian sandwich from Mr. Pickles waiting for me. <laughs> oh, my... Yeah, Rasmus made that. I'm eating picture with those Swedish delicacies. Jim Brown. I still use Rasmus as I'm eating. Someone send me a new one. Oh, yeah? Well, the store is pretty boring. If you drive all the way across the country for the store, you're going to be seriously upset. But we'll still be here you and say hi. Yeah, we'll say hi to you. Ah, uh, I know, Harp. I was hoping you guys all forgot about the CSB swag that's been rotting in boxes in my shop for the last three months. I just talked to Todd, who runs my website and app development today. And uh, we were saying, all right, I think the auction app stuff is all good enough now. Just have to add a, like a watch button and paying in the app, and that's it. Siobhan Wims. And then it's going to be merchandise, merchandising time. So, any day now. Barry Sanders to 25. <laughs> Tank top. Yeah, you can buy one pack. We have packs, we have boxes, it's just kind of small. But there's a little indoor um, Trey Quinn to 99. Oh, yeah, I'm not giving you guys a hard date on the swag, but Therese Fountain, Rising Rookie Relic Auto. Rhino. Holy crap. I haven't seen Rhino forever. So yeah, no one no one said anything about the bidding on the app. Did it work for you? Did you do you guys are you so used to bidding on your desktop that you or your or the mobile page that you didn't even try using the bidding in the app? I didn't hear any complaints, so maybe it was okay. St. Louis, uh drive? I don't know. Like four or five days. <laughs> yeah, from Wisconsin it was like thirty hours. So. Yeah. Another Aaron Rodgers. Yeah, there's been a lot of Disney this week. Yeah, she's probably like 20 some hours. Get on the desktop.
Anyway, you can now bid in the app. It's, it works. Mike Kaseki. It also... Um, it updates in real time. You don't have to refresh it. It's about a five-second delay. But that's enough because if someone outbids you, it adds a minute. So you're not going to miss it. Deshaun Jackson to 299. Girly veteran materials for the Rams. And it's got like the, what has it got? Like the red box if you're outbid, and the green thing if you're the winning bidder, the leading bidder. <laughs> Windows machine. Zay Jones. What happened to Zay Jones? Is he hurt? I haven't heard anything about him. I think he caught a touchdown last week. Oh, okay. It's Russell like his Wilson. first of the year or something. I thought I saw that. Because he was kind of good last year. Anyway, uh, Rhino, I have no idea if the Dodgers are going to pull this thing out. Patrick Mahomes. I think they got to do it tomorrow. I'm a little worried about Game 7 because Ryu is probably their best or second best. I don't know. Kershaw was awesome yesterday. McCown, Miller, Mariota, Holmes, and Tate. Um, I don't know. What a weird series. Yeah. I'm not feeling very good. Yeah. Just being, I guess, just being down again. Yeah. Back's really against the wall. Yeah. All right, I've been trying to hold out through this case, going to the bathroom because I drink a bunch of water and a, maybe a beer, and I'm not going to make it. So, <clears throat> sorry, I'll have to take a quick break before the last box. Callaway rookie, numbered. Not gonna make it. Vitavia and Josh Allen. Rookie Jersey Auto. There we go. Big red. Like, I wouldn't be surprised if the Dodgers just blew up yesterday and scored 20 runs. They're so due. But I've been saying that the entire series and they never do it. So, who knows? Yeah. Sorry, I'll be right back. Just look at this last box and just imagine what could be in there. I'll be right back. <laughs> yeah, I was. I almost was gonna take or tell Omni to open the last box, but yeah. He will. Soon enough. I'm ready for it. Yeah, but then I have to do what you're doing. I don't want to do that. No, you. <laughs> 
Like you, you said you didn't. Uh... If I'm not breaking, I'm not doing anything. Yeah. That's all. Andy Dalton. I'm just gonna set up a hammock. I don't even need to be in the building. That's true. Yeah, eventually. That's gonna happen. Matt Ryan to 299. <laughs> yeah, I think you gotta get. Just to sit in the seat. Tyquan Lewis and. Dante Pettis, rookie jersey auto for the Niners. Jory. I'm just letting him get settled in and comfortable here first. I don't really, I don't have a problem with giving up. Please. <laughs> <laughs> it's not it's not that at all. Derek Carr to 299. Too proud to let somebody else break. No. Yeah, that's not it. Jalen Samuels to 149. We got another points card. We have a two two fifties and a four hundred to random off at the end. Lining up more prism, I know. I know. The secret's out on Prism. There's no there's no getting good deals on Prism. Dante Jackson color. Keenan Allen. What a ridiculous pile of colored parallels we have. Are you trying to keep those in order? There's, there's no, no way. way. <laughs> yeah. Like, first of all, if they were like color coded. Yeah. You know, then Matt Ryan's got a little bottom edge curl going on. And I mean they are somewhat, but like if they if it was like Bowman. I could like try to make a couple different piles, you know. But yeah. I'd have to look at the back of every single card. I know. Lasley. No, I don't really do personals. It doesn't really make any sense anymore. Every I mean occasionally. I don't know of anything right now though. A Jai to two ninety nine and number to ten. It really is number to ten. Edo Smith green patch. Jeez. Edo Smith, the star of the break. Buddy breaking. Callaway. A lot of Callaway colored rookies I remember. Like 900. Mm -hmm. Tom Brady. Most valuable or whatever. Deron Payne. Last pack of the break. We made it. One hour and 11 minutes later. Oh, it's the rainbowy one. Color, what is it? Color rush? Burst? Color burst. Something? Sheen green. Color burst. Color burst. What candy gets handed out? Hmm, good question. We have a good candy basket. It's like a, a, I think we do like a mix one. A little candy, mini candy bars and stuff like that. Reese is for me. That's what you're going to hand out? Yeah. Oh yeah, you that's might get I, some action out there. That's what I like, so. Yeah, Reese's are really good. You know. Darnold, Relics, or Autos? I don't think so. I'm going to do a hit recap if you wait a second. Dual cam break for heavy? Yeah, maybe. All right, first I just want to do the um, points cards. and Well, uh, all right, so we'll do 6, 7, get 250. Number 8 gets 400 on the blue box. I haven't done the blue box for a while. Oh, wait, it's team auctions. It doesn't work. Never mind. It's just going to stay on Big Rab the whole time. That's why I haven't done the things for a while. All right, random.org, I guess. All right, number one will get 400, and two and three will get 250. Trick on Smith, yeah. Uh, Oakland Raiders, JMBBB, 400. And Redskins, Havoc, 250. And Bengals, Josh F, 250. Quick hit recap, which actually won't be quick at all. Extremely long hit recap coming up. What is the deal with Drew Williams? All right. We have the Josh Allen rookie jersey auto for the Bills. 99. Baker Mayfield rookie jersey auto. That one was 70 of 70, if you'll remember. 
We got Dante Pettis, Therese Fountain, Anthony Miller with a nice patch. That thing's numbered to, oh, 99. Another Anthony Miller. Also, oh, 199 on that one. Mason Rudolph, that one was to 10. Ito Smith, Nick Chubb, Laoletta, patch auto to 25. Tom Mack, retired signatures. Ronald Jones, Cortland Sutton, QT, Larry Johnson, Carrion Johnson, Kalen Ballage, Sonny Michelle, rising rookie, football auto. Another Doris Fountain to 75. Oh, yeah, the triple patch autographs. Thielen, Cook, and Diggs. That was cool. Doris Fountain, Nick Chubb, Ito Smith, patch auto. Jalen Samuels, Anthony Miller, Jersey Auto, Bradley Chubb, Patch Auto, Julio Scott, Mark Walton, and Carry On Johnson, Relic Auto. Patches and relics. and relics and plates. Ito Smith, Patch, Gasecki, Gurley Relic, Rosen Patch, Josh Allen Patch, Josh Rosen Relic, Josh Rosen Relic, Prescott, DJ Moore, Michael Gallup. DJ Chark, Ito Smith, Aaron Rodgers, another Josh Rosen, Josh Allen, Royce Freeman, Nick Chubb, Royce Freeman again. We had two plates, Eli Manning and Antonio Callaway. Eli Manning is a yellow plate. The Callaway is magenta. Two one of ones there. Then there's an infinite number of numbered parallels. I don't think we had any super low numbered things. I don't think so either. Yeah, I'm not going to do all of these. This is insane. This is not even all of that's it. That's like a third of it. Yeah, that's a third of the numbered parallels. It's ridiculous. Maybe half. So we won't go through all of those. If there was some like number to five or whatever, but I don't yeah. think there were. I remember several Rosens, several Lamar Jacksons for the yeah. rookies. I should have kept the rookies separately, but 